happening everyone fast food toy reviews here today we have something kind of cool it's a scooby-doo set of four awesome looking collectibles released by burger king back in 1996 now you've seen something similar this is the imported uk release as opposed to the usa release which i reviewed a long time ago so this one here has four toys in the set where the u.s release you can see here if you remember has five toys in the set another curious thing that you might take note of is that the scooby-doo here here on the little picture here has a blue collar but the actual figure has a tan collar so what do you make of that so anyway let's get these things opened up and have a closer look first up in the set we have the mystery machine which looks amazing so i always found that the mystery machine over the year is one of the coolest toys i think of all the scooby-doo stuff that's come out over the years the millions of different things they've come out with one of the most coolest things in my opinion that i like the most is the mystery machine gimmicks that they've come out with some of the coolest toys were made out of the mystery machine over the years. I just love this thing. So if you look inside, you can see Shaggy and Scooby and Scooby has his eyes covered. And in the back, let's see if we can get in there. You see Fred and Velma. And there is like a zombie monster in there behind them chasing them. They're all scared. Let's see if we can get in there really close. There you go. You can see what's going on in there. And it has a pullback feature. That's part of the gimmick. One of my favorite gimmicks with these toys is the pullback feature. And these little wheels right here kind of bounce up and down. They're kind of like little moving bits right in there. And in the front here, you see this little nub? <laughs> so it's supposed to, I think kind of like wobble like scooby and shaggy in there they're supposed to like kind of bounce around you can see them shaking around in there and i don't know mine just doesn't like kind of do anything other than just go forward so if anybody out there has this particular toy let me know if yours kind of zigzags and spins around and zips in different directions because mine this kind of goes the one one straight line <laughs> It seems as though because of the way these are that it wants to like zigzag and spin around and everything, but it doesn't do that. So maybe it's just mine. I don't know. Maybe mine's just malfunctioning. I don't know. <laughs> it's fun. Sometimes it goes super fast and then sometimes it goes super slow. Maybe it's just due to the age of the toy. You can hear the wind-up gimmick in there. It's very strong and powerful. So maybe it's just mine not working properly. I don't know, but it's still fun. Look at it. It still goes. So it's a win for me. And anyway, there you go. It's the mystery machine. Now this next one I find kind of entertaining. It's Scooby-Doo inside of his little doghouse, which I think is kind of awesome. <laughs> Look at this thing. Let me give you a little spinneroo here. And then you can see Scooby-Doo hanging out. This little tongue sticking out. He's got a little water dish, his bone, the grass. This is just, this one's really neat looking. And underneath, that's part of the gimmick right here. It's the pullback feature. Yes, I love the pullback feature. It's got the three little wheels here. And then all you do is you pull it back like this. And that's what he does. He just kind of like bounces in and out of his little doghouse. <laughs> that's what he does. <laughs> and I find it curious because you can do this. You wind it up and then you let it go. And he doesn't do anything like this while you're holding it. It only works when you set it down like that. <laughs> It's great. I love it. And that's as far as it goes. Okay, let's see. There we go. So you can see that's what he's doing. He goes in and out of his little doggy house. <laughs> so there you go. It's Scooby-Doo. Next up we have Velma, Scooby, and Daphne hiding inside of like this haunted crypt coffin thing. And you can see there is a ghost with some chains and bats. And there's a little rat down there. Oh, that's kind of cool. It's spooky too. Look at there's even a little spider. Some little hidden eyes. A ghost. So it's basically the same picture on this side, just reversed. And underneath, what do we have? Oh, look! It's a pullback feature. Look at it, it's still going. So all you do is you pull it back like this. Watch this. Ready? And their little heads bobble up and down. <laughs> okay, we'll do it from this angle. Here we go. <laughs> That's great. Okay, watch. Come on. Come on. We can do it. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Look at that. <laughs> that's great so there you have it it's the velma scooby and daphne little coffin thing <laughs> so i'm not sure exactly what you want to call this one so we'll just call this one the scooby and shaggy running scared toy there's no specific names on the packages so again just like the other ones it has a pullback feature but unfortunately for mine like see the little legs here they're supposed to spin and that's part of the gimmick. You pull it back and then the little legs are supposed to twirl around 
whoa, he takes right off fast. So the pullback gimmick itself still works just fine. There you go. As you can hear, it still works. But the little mecha mechanism inside that's supposed to help spin the legs is not functioning properly. And it kind of works if you hold it upside down. So if you were to wind it up like this, and then you hold it upside down, it kind of moves and wiggles and it kind of locks into place a little bit. But when you flip it back over, now it's just, so one of the little plastic bits in there probably, due to the age of the toy, I mean, it's creeping up on a 30 year old set. So it probably has something to do with that. So whatever's going on in there is malfunctioning, but that's okay. You can just do this, use your imagination and pretend like they're running. You know, I don't care. It's still awesome to me because I love Shaggy and Scooby. And I love the pullback feature. So it's a complete win for me. So there you go. It's Scooby-Doo and Shaggy. There you have it, everyone. Scooby-Doo set of four awesome little toys released by Burger King way, way back in 1996. Now remember, this is the UK release as opposed to the USA release, which I've already reviewed a number of years ago. This was really cool. The Mr. Machine, you got Scooby in the doghouse, the malfunctioning little running Scooby toy, and then the coffin one, which I think is kind of cute too. Thanks for watching, everybody. Take care. See you next time.